The whole program is designed to help all of the high school kids in the city of Yuma. Football is the next board up, so we're, uh, we, we can afford to be a little bit slower right now and, uh, and try to develop these kids, get them better. Meanwhile, local prep sports summer tradition makes a comeback. Less than a week after graduations took place across Yuma County, the Prep Boys Basketball Summer League tipped off for the eighth time. This time around, programs from across the Yuma area took part in the summer's opening scrimmages at Yuma High School. We bring you one of the scrimmages from Yuma's Auxiliary Gym as Coach Jeff Frazine and Kofa would ball up against Coach Luke Stuckey and Yuma Catholic. We pick it up in the closing minutes of the scrimmage. YC's Ryder vote gets the call underneath, manages to get the composure going and finishing the play underneath. More with the Shamrocks offense. The missed shot inside, rebound by Vogt, kicks it out to a teammate who knocks down the outside jumper. But Kofa would also turn it up. Off the defensive board you're about to see, the fast momentum break goes into the hands of Joaquin Anaya, using his quickness and length to get the finger roll bucket. Both teams had a good showing in this one as Yuma Criminals and Sabol Raiders also participated. We caught up with Criminals head coach Kurt Weber who explains why the Summer League is invaluable for all its participants. It's a huge part of the season for us is to get these kids play at court time and uh, get them some minutes, get them under live situations against other people, not the people they see every day at practice, uh, but people that are, that are, you know, probably a notch better than they are. And uh, you don't develop unless you challenge yourself a little bit. So we're really excited about the opportunities. The Summer League scrimmages will continue every Tuesday and Thursday afternoon at Yuma High School until the end of June. Imperial Valley will likely have four to five programs participating in the Summer League in the weeks ahead as well.